Hello, I'm Michael Hall, founder of Hall Gates. Today I'd like to discuss the ratings of your vehicle. The gross vehicle weight rating, the gross axle weight rating, the gross combined weight rating, and also payload rating and towing. Many of these numbers are found in your owner's manual, but nearly all vehicles will have some of these printed on the door jam. So there's a couple stickers just inside the door jam. One has the VIN on it. It'll have the uh, GVWR, which is the gross vehicle weight rating. As you see here, it's 7,050 pounds. Also has the front GAWR and rear GAWR. What that, says, what that is, is the gross axle weight rating. And for the front, that's 3,525 pounds. And for the rear, 3,800 pounds. You'll also find a tire loading sticker. What this shows is the total weight that you can add to this vehicle. So that's 1,864 pounds in this vehicle. Another number to be aware of is curb weight. Of these various numbers, curb weight is the lightest. That's how you got it from the dealership without any accessories on it yet. So you have curb weight. The next highest one would be the gross vehicle weight rating. GVWR, and then the largest number that you'll find is going to be gross combined weight rating, GCWR. And what that is, is the maximum that this vehicle, anything in it, and anything attached to it can be. So combined weight of everything. That number isn't in the door jam. That gross combined weight rating number you'll find in your owner's manual. Many vehicles will also have a tow rating. That would be GTWR. You have a gross vehicle weight rating and you have a tow rating. But when you add those together, you won't get the gross combined weight rating. So the automakers assume that if you're going to be at the max towing, that this is empty and vice versa. So please don't use your gross vehicle weight rating and your maximum towing. Unfortunately, this is what many people do. Right? We load up the vehicle with the family and the ice chest and everything and then we attach it to the max trailer that, that we can pull. Um, if you do that, you'll usually go over the gross combined weight rating. So if you're towing, the automakers assume that you're the only one in here and uh, if this is loaded, they assume that you're pulling a, a white trailer. So you can't have both together usually. So the gross combined weight rating is 16,200. Uh, this vehicle, just empty, is around uh, 5,500 pounds. And so what this means is if I'm towing 10,000 pounds, I don't have much room to put more in this vehicle. So that combined weight rating is again, what the entire vehicle, whatever's in it and whatever's connected to it can be.